So I was surprised to read that 36% of people think that science is just for geniuses. I am not a genius. You know, as we go forward in this uh, century, there's going to be a lot of issues that only science can solve. You know, when I was a kid, I can remember my parents saying, well, you know, I wasn't good at math, therefore I can't help you with your math homework or your science homework. I think that's the wrong approach because then these kids, like myself, have this kind of unconscious bias that because my parents weren't good at something, that means I'm not going to be good at it too. So I think it's important if you were a parent that wasn't good at science, you could say, hey, I didn't have the opportunity to learn about science like you do. And you have this great opportunity and it's something you can be good at. So these are all things that we can do. Make science interesting for kids, as an example. You know, I was a disinterested kid that spent you know, most of my time looking out the window or looking at the clock, hoping to get out of the classroom. But if you could capture, you know, kids' imaginations with an educational program that shows how science is important to them, how it's important to our future, and how there are opportunities for these kids to get involved in science, because it is going to be so very important. I mean, we have a growing population in this world. In 2050, we're going to have 9 billion people on this planet that kind of population increase they're going to cause issues with the environment food and water shortages energy sustainability things that only science can solve and understanding the state of science as it exists right now is so very important to our future